Hey friends, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we discuss about the life of a plant, understanding their amazing behavior. What is a plant? Living things, they grow in the soil and remain fixed at a place through their roots. What is the life of a plant? The life cycle of plant starts from the seed which is buried in the soil through different methods. It germinates and gives rise to the first leaves known as seedling. From this the growth of the plant continue and it reach a mature stage. Seeds germinate and grow into a plant. Germination is the phase of plant growth when the seed begins to sprout. Plants are living things that grow from the soil, take light from the sun, make their own food. The process is named as photosynthesis. Mature plant produce flowers. Do you know why are plants in green color? Because plants are full of light absorbing chemical called chlorophyll. Chlorophyll capture the sunlight to make sugar during the process is called photosynthesis. The process of photosynthesis produces oxygen which is released by the plant into the air. Chlorophyll gives plants their green color because it doesn't absorb the green wavelength of light. Green light is not generally absorbed by plant because its wavelength doesn't fulfill the minimum requirements for photosynthesis making it inefficient. The mature plants produce flowers, which ensures that the life cycle continue. A mature plant has leaf, roots and a stem. After the plant become mature, the plant grows into a flower and the seeds are produced. Then the mature plant would have the stem, flower, fruits, roots and leaves. The reproductive part of the plant is the flower. They make the seeds which turn them into a plant. The main stages in the life cycle of a plant areas seed, seed germination, seedling, adult plant, pollination and last one is fertilization and the formation of fruits and seeds. Plants follow a cyclic process of starting a new life, growing then coming back to the starting stage reproducing. There are the five stages of a plant life cycle. Are plants alive or living? Yes, plants are living things. Because they fulfill all the characteristics of living things, movement with environmental changes and human interaction, trees do move. Plant produce its own food, act as a source of nutrition for other life farms and is the only source of oxygen in nature. And now we discuss the parts of plant. Each part has a specific job in order to keep the plant healthy. Leaves perform photosynthesis. Stem gives spores to the plant. Transporting, storing and reproducing. Roots absorb water and minerals. What does a plant need to grow? Sunlight. Plant requires sunlight as their energy source for photosynthesis, a process which converts carbon dioxide and water into glucose. Air. Plant needs carbon dioxide to make food and to have energy. Plant cells release own energy by breaking down sugar and using up oxygen. The two primary reasons plant need is air to photosynthesis and breathe. Why does plant needs to breathe? Because just as we need to breathe to stay alive, plants must also exchange gases with the atmosphere to function. Two key gases, oxygen, which is used in aerobic respiration, where food molecules are broken down to release energy for growth, and the carbon dioxide, making their own food like glucose in the process of photosynthesis. 
the next one is soil soil helps the plant up roots grow down into the soil soil provide nutrients and water soil itself is not really needed by the plants just the nutrients and the water in it water water helps move nutrients from the soil into the plant too much water can cause a plant's root to rot too little water can cause the plant to wilt or drop water is an essential nutrients for the plant nutrients plants need nutrients in order to germinate grow fight off pest and reproduce plants and people plants are crucial for human survival without plants there would be no food plants provide us medicines like spinach spinach is rich in iron and fiber low in fats and cholesterol it is good good for weight control eyes wounds and blood pressure ginger can boost up digestion and give us support our immune system paracetamol these tablets are also obtained from plants plants provide cloths cotton fiber come from the seeds of the cotton plant cotton is the world most widely used natural fiber plants provide shelter and safety for animals plants also provide a place for animals to find other food as a habitat plant alter the climate on a small scale plants provide shade help moderate the temperature and protect animal from the wind and the plants helps to provide oxygen to animal for the process of respiration they also maintain the balance of oxygen and carbon dioxide in the atmosphere so plants are very important in our life hope you like this video thanks for watching